Hi and welcome back to my channel. Hi, Hi baby. Today we're going into Hi, Hi baby. An antique store. It's called Metcalf Sisters. So we're gonna go see what we can buy and sell on eBay. Let's go. So right when you walk in, they have like furniture out in the back. They have two entrances. And this is like where they keep all the big furniture. But I love those little paper boats. I've always seen trains or cars, but never the boats. And they wanted 32 on the boats. And that was $10 just for the spoon, not including the bowls or the ladle. $85 on the clock. little puppy figurines the red dot I don't know if it means a dollar or if it means uh, two dollars they normally have a sign at the front of the store where the cash register is I really love these forty eight dollars a little cat I've never seen the cat on the nest before. I've always seen the hens or the bunnies. The cat was cute. I wish it had the, the bottom piece and it didn't have a price on it. But I've sold a tiny chicken that looks the same color as this. And it was the hen on the nest for $20 and it was so tiny but it's so cute. I like the duck. I've never seen the duck either. Nine dollars on the little red creamer. And there was quite a bit of people so whenever I pan down to the floor it's me trying not to get other people in the camera. That little booth right here is 50% off. And they have some baggies back here. $12.50 on the little turkey dish. And the baggies have marbles in it. My favorite. <laughs> Six dollars on the blue bag. I haven't seen the really big ones like that before. Three dollars on this one. I don't know if you can see it, but it's like a uh, striped. Three fifty. Again, I would not buy those for resell. I was going to keep them for myself. $3.50 on that pack. They're so fun. $33 on, I think these are door pulls. That's what all those look like. Dresser accessories. I wish the little teapots, the lid came off, but it's all one piece. And when I'm in this antique store, I cannot do comps because because uh, my phone's really slow in here. I think it's because of the building, which is fine. $24 on this panda decanter. I've never seen one look like that, and it kind of looks like a raccoon. A smiley face, it's a piggy bank. They want $17 on it. 
Now when I go to antique stores, I know that the prices are going to be higher, but sometimes they have sales in here and sometimes I can get lucky in here. Um, or if I know it sells higher for that, then I will do it. But I like this whole little set right here. And me personally, if this was my booth, I wouldn't put an end table right in front of the shelf. I don't know. A whole bunch of Tupperware over here. $12.50. I would love, 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 love to have an antique store of my own, but I would set it up different, like kind of like a boutique where all the shelving were the same and it was really well lit because every time I go to an antique store, it's always so dark and I know it's because they're older buildings, but. $34 on that planter. I do love this. Made in Mexico. Little frog. I mean, <laughs> that's not a frog, guys. That's a turtle. <laughs> that was a turtle. I love this cookie jar. It said $15. He was cute. It's a weenie dog, $24, with the little shots on it, little shot glasses, but it was missing one cup. I love that little tea set. I love blue and white. It was $34 for the whole thing though. Chicken pitcher says made in Italy on the tag. $6 on the measuring cup set. These are little salt and pepper shakers. Looks like they say Shirley on the bottom, and it's five dollars, but they got them as fifty percent off, so it makes them two fifty. I really like this. Five dollars. It says as is, so I need to look at it and see if there's any cracks or chips. It does say Italy. I love that baby blue color with the floral. So cute. It says candy dish, Italy as is. I do see a little paint chip right there. And it's 20% off. I don't see any other damage to it not here. <laughs> I'll have to wait till I get home. But there's no carts or buggies or baskets or anything like that here, so I'll have to go take it up to the front while I keep shopping. I do like selling teacups and saucers. This is $5 for the set. It's Royal Ascot. I don't know. I'm gonna look at it. Made in England. I end up putting it back. Maybe I should have grabbed it, but I do put it back. And I really like that picture, but in that punch bowl and all the cups that went with it was on sale 30% off. All these little vintage toys are part of the same booth. I 
like the little skunk. He's cute. Five dollars. And then it said 50% off all the little Christmas in this little booth, so I wanted to look at it. Another little Tupperware, $8. And that's $8, but it's 50% off, so it's 4 little car, little race car, that was $15 on the doll, and then 50% off this, it does say as is, and it's $25. It has a lot of pieces on the inside. I do like the dominoes right there too. $12 on the Chuck E. Cheese little truck, but it's 50% off. And then that's $8 as well, 50% off. So I'm gonna grab this. And I don't know if they have much of a resale, but I wanted it for the kids. It says it's a 91 piece set. I don't know if they're all in there. When I opened it, they were all the way up to the top. So I'm not sure if all 90 pieces or 91 pieces are in there, but that's okay. $50 on those crystals. Those are amazing. And they have all of these crystals as well. I always thought it was really cool when people can go out and the, go find those or crack open the rocks and find them. I don't know. I remember when I was a kid, we went to Arkansas and went like digging for gold. It was like at a little, like a little place that they let you go to the little dirt area and then you mined for it. <laughs> And you just mostly find like little rocks, but it was still fun. $3 on that little Christmas tree pin. Volt's graph right there. Little bunny Valentine. $1.50. Six dollars on the little jar of pins. I do pick up this, it's thirty percent off. Brown bag cookie art, nineteen eighty four. I know that these are a good seller. little chalkware birds. Now, these are $12 a piece and there was two of them, so that's why I left them behind. And normally with the birds, there would be more than just two. They had a lot of chalkware figurines over here. I like the little seasoning, the little birds back there.
little towel, a little hand towel with a cat and a puppy. Oh, it's not a hand towel. It's a calendar. I wonder if all of these are calendars. That one says 2001. Again, if <laughs> I did have to keep the camera down for a little bit. A little Mickey Mouse, $10. He was really heavy. I was not expecting that. It's like one of those. Uh, I, they have like weights at the bottom. So you can just keep playing with it and it won't fall completely down. If that makes sense. <laughs> it's a baby toy. All the vintage books. Do you like this Saki set? $2 for the whole thing. And recently when I was at Goodwill, I found one of those by itself without the little cups in the little, what would you call that? The little pitcher. That part was going to be $2. So at least I get the two little cups that go with it. And it probably came with more little cups. I really like that. $27.50. Little vintage Christmas tree down there. cookie box was cool. I didn't notice it when I was in the store. They had a whole bunch of these. They say Tom and Jerry. I don't know. They were all individually priced too. I like that little Barbie box. 17. Little ashtrays in this little container down here, two fifty. I love that little blue kitten, two fifty. So cute. I like the puppies too. It says two fifty. I've never seen it like that. The little aspirin, those little tiny packs. And they still had the original plastic wrap, but I don't think you can sell that on eBay. I don't know. Never tried, so <laughs> that was four dollars on that playing card set. $4.99 on this. It was $9.99. My daughter thought it was so cute because it had little birds on the inside. You can see her trying to grab it. <laughs> it's Lucite. I do pick this up. I do like Lucite pieces. So I always see like the Lucite grapes or the Lucite um, candles. Well, I've only seen them online. I haven't seen the candles myself, but the grapes I see a lot. At a higher price. So I went ahead and picked this up. But I'm going to head back home and I'll show you everything that I got. Alright, so we're back home. I did pick up this super cute candy dish. It says made in Italy. And the only thing that I saw wrong with it when I got home. Was that little chip right there in the paint. And then down here there's a little chip on the base. But that's it. So I'm fine with that. So pretty. And I did pick up the sake. Came with two cups. Made in Japan. Obviously. 
and I did pick up the Lucite piece that my daughter was in love with. It does have like some chips and like some scuffs on it, but I think that's normal for its age. It's really heavy. And I did pick up the Little Bear Cookie Press Brown Bag Cookie Art 1984. And I did pick up the Dominoes, but the Dominoes are for me and the kids. And that's going to be the end of today's video. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe.